Freaky here, and today we're going to be doing another Funko News video. You're probably wondering, where the hell am I at? I'm actually at my mom's house. See, I'm at, this is my little scenery, just for this exclusive video, by the way. Let me get up and show you guys what I got. From Bucket Collection, I got the Blue Beetle one. Oh, fuck, that really scuffed up some. I got that. Um, I got Jigsaw right here. Or, Billy the Puppet, my apologies, face. Haunted Mansion, Popcorn Cups. My Prime collection, I drink Prime every day. I'm about, I'm bulking up, bro, you feel me? I'm bulking up. But yeah, I just got that. But anyways, um, that's that's besides the point. I'm mainly here because, you know, I want to visit my family. But we got Funko news, so let's do this. It's time my revenge comes to fruition. Hey guys, so the first Funko news we have is we actually have a new Eddie Funko Pop coming soon. Now, this is a metallic one. I do not know the retailer is for this, but this is coming soon. We also have a Loki and Mobius 1982 or 1984 two-pack. Cool, it's an exclusive, I assume, but I definitely will be getting this one. <laughs> that two-pack is going to look so freaking awesome. And I just hope they do make it because I definitely will be grabbing this one. New Blackpink Deluxe album coming soon, which, okay. A new StarCraft pop coming soon. A new Diablo exclusive, I think, or common, I'm not entirely sure. Some new World of Warcraft pops. They're still making those pops. I remember that when World of Warcraft first came out, I think, 2012 or 2013. We also have some Funko episodes coming soon, upcoming Funko Shop exclusives. But we have a new Grabber Red Molding exclusive, which will be one I definitely will be grabbing. I, for a fact, want this exclusive. And I'm so excited for this to come out because this one is just fire looking. So have Devil Homer with like the Maracas, I think. Funko exclusive. Probably I'm going to be getting this one. F my life. We also have a 18 inch Loki coming soon. Um, which is a Funko exclusive. I believe we got 18 inch pop for Cyber Monday. So my guess is this will be Cyber Monday. I'm definitely thinking it will be. The Funko shop on um, Tuesday for eBay, we had the Glow Warhammer Titan that went up on the Funko eBay store, which was available in the Funko shop the following day. I really thought this was my boy, Fab Five Freddy, Soldier Boy, but unfortunately it wasn't, so that's a bummer. He'll be coming soon, though, which I will be grabbing him whenever he does. We also have a Funko exclusive J from Jay and Silent Bob, or it's J or Bob, I'm not entirely sure. Never seen this show before. Man and Chronic Boy, I might butcher that two-pack for NYCC 2019. I remember when I was in line at FYE, there was a collector there who wanted us to buy him one because, you know, he was, he was a reseller, which I didn't resell back then, but now I resell, so I respect his grind. But, yeah, it was, just, it was still nice to help a collector out, I guess. A, then we have some new Clark 3 Pops, which is Jay and Silent, Jay and Silent Bob. I'm not entirely sure what these are, but there's a new wave There's a wave of them coming. This is the new Mandalorian Season 3 Pops coming soon. The only one I do want is that Bo-Katan on Throne. That was the only one I'm wanting, and it just looks cool looking. A new Jason Voorhees Funko Pop coming. There's actually an entire redone, like a whole reprint. The pick I have is the old one up at the top, and the bottom is a new one. The new one is pretty cool. I am definitely am hoping to get this one somehow. Funko Shop, we had the Sasuke, Glow in the Dark, and the Bloody Damage. Um, Sasuke, as you call it. That's pretty cool. Then, the Naruto trend keeps coming. We have Kakashi, Box Lunch for pre-sale. I actually thought it was going to be in stock, but it wasn't. So, whenever this does hit stores, um, I will try it again, hopefully. Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer and Clara, or Clary, two-pack, I think. This is a pocket pop keychain. We still haven't got a pop of Clara, or Clary. I might be saying that wrong. I don't really know how to... I'm at two pop news, which is me. I love the watermark that I... That I'm, I mean, that they did. I also have some new Ahsoka Pops coming soon with Thrawn and a bunch of other ones. Now, I just need Thrawn because, like I said, I love Thrawn. He was my favorite from the trailer. Still haven't finished the show. I'm still watching it. I'm actually just catching up on Loki right now. Maybe tomorrow if I'm bored and instead of thinking about my loneliness, maybe I'll actually sit down and watch some Ahsoka. You know, maybe I'll do that. It's coming soon. We have a 332 Commander Trooper that is an exclusive to Target. We have a Hot Topic, Topic exclusive Ahsoka Pop, a Funko exclusive Clone Trooper, and a Entertainment Earth exclusive Sith Trooper or some type of trooper. I need that Funko Shop Clone Trooper without a freaking doubt. Also, the next upcoming Target Funko Friday exclusive is the T-Rex Dinozord Power Ranger Funko Pop. Now, I definitely will be getting this one. I really do hope this does hit stores by the release date because I will be there to get that pop. I am just so happy Target is back. These type of Funko Fridays, 
I literally hated when the Funko Fridays was an entire freaking category or an entire set. Like, one year it was Retro Toys. Those were pretty cool. The next year it was those freaking stupid art series. And the next year it was the freaking DC Pops or the freaking DC Superhero Pops. I didn't get those two Pops, two Pop sets. I did want the Super Shredder one, but I didn't buy them. Unfortunately, I couldn't find them in stores. It's actually a Target Friday that I really want. I'm hoping Funko can start doing this from now on because... Like I said, I like when they do when they do this shit. It's really freaking cool. And man, I cannot wait for Target Con 2024. Actually, it's gonna go so hard. We have some new Loki pops. We have Sylvie, um, Miss Minutes, and the other girl. And we got my main Nick Kang, bro. We have my main <laughs> Kang, bro. I totally need this man. Freaking Victor Timeling. This is, I, I think he's in the newest episode. I haven't watched it yet. I, I'm actually starting to watch it, so I'm hoping he is in the episode. Because when I see this man, ho oh, ho. I'm a freak out, bro. You know me. I love Kang. Jonathan Majors, completely innocent. Screw with the. I love that guy to death, bro. Black Light DC Joker Pop and T Bundle GameStop exclusive. Okay. Most collectibles exclusive. My Hair Academia Funko Pops. Do need this one. Do not want that chase. So just be going with the comment if I can get it somehow. We also have a new Civil War build a scene set of Captain America. Not, don't really care for it, but it's nice to know that set is complete. I have a new Snoop Dogg that's exclusive to the dog house. Really just Snoop Dogg in some fancy clothes and it's flocked. So 15,000 pieces. I think it's only exclusive to the actual dog house. So any Hollywood or Cali fans, um, go scoop that up for your Snoop Dogg set. Also have some brand new Funko NFTs of Funko Ween. Now these are friggin' gonna be fire, dude. We got Proto a zombie and so far we got Freddy. Funko is a friggin' samurai, glow in the dark. This is just so awesome and I personally cannot wait to get these. These are going live October 31st on drop. So I don't know, cannot wait to get these though. So thank you all for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Hit the bell, join the Foot Clan. I'm out guys, have a good day. Peace. It is time my revenge comes to fruition. I am here to destroy you all. You killed him! He was your brother! And you killed him! He was your brother, Saki! Your best friend!